Oh, right. We had to call 911. Hi, hello, yes, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so I have a bit of a surprise for you guys. Today is a special day, as you can tell from the title. We're going to the Renaissance Festival! I'm so excited. Some of my voice is down. It's just my dad's in the kitchen, and I don't want to hear her. I don't want him hearing me. But we are, me and Colin are going to the Renaissance Festival. We might meet some friends there. I'm super excited. I haven't been since last year, and yeah, I will be vlogging the thing. My costume is pretty cool. So yeah. I forgot to say, make sure you like and subscribe and comment down below what was your favorite part of this vlog. I am definitely very excited to go. It actually has been like, I think a year. It has been a year because I didn't go during COVID because Corona. But yeah, I'm so excited. Colin's costume is amazing. I am definitely excited. I'm going to go from a TikTok and then you guys can see my costume. But honestly, we can't wear this to the Renaissance Festival. No transition. So I have my costume on. I feel like a fucking badass. Also, this is Colin. His costume. To a better view of him. But this is him. Yes, hi. <laughs> and um, yeah, we are gonna go inside for the Renaissance and a few. But we might grab food first. I don't know. You know the plan is. I mean, it depends if for food, it depends what we see first. If we can't find anything on the way, we'll probably just find something at a concession stand. In there there's generally a lot of stuff uh as for the festival we just go and enjoy ourselves for a good few hours until we feel like going home such a serious man he is no it's just somebody in this relationship has to plan stuff <laughs> true y'all the line is so busy oh my jesus like we might have to walk which is totally fine by me We just got done with the tomatoes and the guy absolutely roasted us and it was beautiful because I told him I work with preschoolers and they go, they allowed you to be alone with preschoolers and he roasted Colin. It was beautiful. So we're waiting for kettle corn right now. Sorry if I haven't been like recording a lot. It's just because they don't allow phones that much. And also, I just want to live in the moment. It's been so much fun. I can't wait to show you the jousting and everything else. I'm just so excited. Also, I got, I got this necklace. And then I also got this little guy. We are now leaving. We just got my corset, which I'll show you guys like a full view of that. Holy crap, my back's never felt this good. And you got a massage. How do you feel about your massage? He's happy about it. Remember to go to my place and just snuggle. So we are doing face masks right now. My face feels weird. This is wrong on so many levels. Why is it wrong on so many levels? I can't say it, otherwise I'll get canceled. <laughs> Colin! Emily! Anyways, 
We just got back from the Renaissance Festival. I'm so sorry if I didn't record that much. I was trying to live in the moment. And besides, this jerk wouldn't record. <laughs> but we just got done watching a movie. I'm going to bed after this because I'm exhausted. And yeah. All right, my friends. I'll see you later. Remember to spread awareness, spread kindness, and spread love. Dance world. Do you want to say bye on three? One, three. two, three. Dance bye. world. Bye. Oh my god. Okay, try again. You get one more. You get one more chance. You get one more chance. Okay. <laughs> one, two, three. Bye. bye. Hold up. Aren't you forgetting something? Wait, what do you mean I'm forgetting something? Oh, I don't know. The reason why you had to call 911? Oh, right. We had to call 911. So before anyone freaks out, everyone was okay in this story. But basically what happened was me and Colin were driving to the Renaissance Festival. We were super late because we got lost. And while we were driving, there was these two cars. This one car was driving super fast. And while he was driving super fast, this other car pulled up and he ran into the other car with the headlight being shattered completely. And I was like, oh my God. And then the two other cars got crashed as well. So I'm freaking out. I hear this one lady yelled, oh my God. Colin being the hero he is, he ran out of the car to check out the two people. I was so frozen and shocked that I couldn't like speak. But what I did do was I did call 911, explained what happened, and they're like, okay, is someone really injured? And Colin said, no, no one was really injured. So it was quite terrifying. I promise this is not clickbait. I do have, I don't have footage from the crash, but I do have the receipt that I did call 911. So I am literally not even making this up. I kind of wish I was. <laughs> this is not clickbait. But yeah, no, it was completely terrifying. And I was like, Oh my god, what the fuck. I didn't even speak for 30 minutes because I was too in shock and shaken up. We had to stop at McDonald's because we were like, uh... So yeah, again, so sorry if the footage is all clipped up. It's just we were so in the moment having fun. They really didn't allow footage in some stores, which is totally understandable. So yeah, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Remember to spread awareness, spread kindness, and love. All right. Stay trippy little hippies.